I'm live. What? I always look like a greased up pig. Let's try to do something about this lighting. I'm trying to. Oh my God, I'm a ghost. I'm so good at YouTube. Hooray! And we are live and we're doing a live stream drawing a thing. How's it going, everybody? I've got three viewers at the moment. That's cool. How's everybody doing? Seems like the world's burning down at our very feet. Me, I'm sweaty. That's how I'm doing. I am sweaty and I'm full of stress and anxiety. So I'm going to draw. I'm going to draw. Draw, draw, draw. Draw, draw. Draw, draw, draw. I don't know why my camera does that thing. Where are all the people at? Where everybody at? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I got my big stupid drawing board again. Big stupid drawing board. It's big and it's stupid and I like to draw on it. You people are dead to me. Unless you come back. Hey. Wonder is there a way I can see how many people I got? How do I look? Participants to me. Cool. All right then. <clears throat> Hi guys. Uh, if you're watching the live stream, go ahead and uh, say something in the chat. Say hello. Tell your friends I want to teach you guys how to draw. I want to teach some drawing skills. I want to play some Pictionary. I want to do some fun shit. I want to get people's minds off the utter chaos and pandemonium that our existence is becoming. So let's have some fun. Draw some pictures. Anyone watching have a suggestion? Something they want to see me draw? You want to learn how to draw something? I'll show you how to do it. Cause that's what I do. Hey Jenna, welcome back. Thank you for watching. Thank you for sharing. I super duper appreciate it. I'm glad we got some some people interested. Got a small but loyal base of people that are interested in watching me be an idiot, and that's awesome. And I love it. Oh, let's do a drawing. I've got a pile of markers. My small office space is slowly becoming more and more cluttered as I do more stupid video projects in here and don't clean up after myself. Yeah, I'm disgusting. Another thing I'm working on, um, I'm gonna do a video soon where I'm gonna I'm gonna order a bunch of LARPing shit or something off of Wish and then see what it actually looks like compared to the pictures on their website. So that'll be fun. I've actually got a whole backlog of shit that I'm going to be doing, but go ahead. Somebody, I uh, got six people watching now. That's awesome. Thank you very much. Oh no, it's five now. Let's do, uh, let's, let's do some suggestions. Anyone watching? Tell me something you want to watch me draw. Let's do it. I'm just going to try to get some more people in here. I'm whore. I'm whore. I know this is boring, but I got to do it. 
All right. So who wants to see me draw? I know y'all are watching. Five minutes in, I haven't doodled shit. What should I draw? What? How to draw a dog. Okay, cool. How to draw a dog. That'll be fun. So your basic dog, you're going to take a... You're going to make a line. We're drawing an invisible dog now. Try to keep up. Yeah. Can you do it? Can you replicate that? Let's try this again. Okay, let's let's draw. Sorry, I gotta erase the invisible dog. Silly. I got a pile of markers, but thank you. <clears throat> okay, so we're gonna start with a curved line like that. Like um you know, kinda like my eyebrows. Oh man. I need marker sponsorships. Yeah, that'd be awesome. So you draw a curved line, okay? And then you draw another curved line. That's gonna be his tail. And then you go just like that. Oh, it's easy. And then we're gonna do like a weenie dog. So I'm gonna give him a little bit of a booty right there. And then dogs have those weird backwards knees. Oh no, this dog's gonna look all kinds of wrong. Oh my God, no. Dog's got some big feet. Just some bendy lines for legs. And this dog's got some large feet. <laughs> but that's okay. We're not gonna judge this puppers. We love them anyway. It's okay. That's just how dog Jesus made him. It's fine. And then what we're going to do is we're going to draw two curved lines. And we're going to draw a circle and then a little bigger circle. Give him a little collar, just like that. And then I do that little thingy and that's going to be his nose. And then we'll do like a uh, One of these little deals. Give him a neck. Are you following along, kids? I sure hope so. Like, share, and subscribe, and tell your friends, and hit the bell, and all that. Good. So then we just do like a circle, kind of around that little nose thing we drew, and then we do like a little curved line here, and then two circles for eyes. And then like a half circle here for the ridge of his nose. And then we'll do like uh, some floppity ears here. And another half circle for the top of his head. That is a long necked dog. He's got a long neck. What? That's bizarre. What have I done? Oh, what has science done? And then we're gonna draw a couple of bendy lines here, right? And then you give your dog a thumb and you give him a forefinger and you give him a couple more fingers. Wait a minute, dogs don't have hands. What's happening? Uh-oh, what's he doing? Oh, oh, it must be, must be morning and the dog is just enjoying his coffee. Like that. There, you happy, Malcolm? It's it's a morning dog. And he's just having some coffee. And now you can draw a dog. Isn't that cool? That's how you draw a dog. All right, let's do something else. All right, let's do something. What, what do you guys want me to draw? 
Let's get this party going. Get your friends in here. Share it. Subscribe it. Hi, Joe. Thanks for joining us. This is always fun. You're always good about sharing. Let's do it. What are we drawing? My dog. That's okay. My dog had a hand. The dogs don't all have to look like they look. <sighs> Let's draw some pictures. Thank you, Joe. I appreciate that. Hopefully we get some more views. Let's do it. Let's get a party. Let's do this. Party it up. All right. I think I'm going to show you guys. Let's try drawing Batman again because a lot of people like drawing Batman. I think Batman's easy to draw. I think he's fun. So we're going to try Batman again. You guys can get your practice in. So you're going to start with a curved line at the top. That's going to be the top of Batman's head. But this time we're going to go with old school Adam West Batman. So instead of points, you're going to do like uh, picket fence points. Like that. It's like curvy triangle looking things. Okay. And then uh, you're going to draw some straight lines down for the sides of his head. And you're going to... You're going to go just beyond the chin. And then for old Adam West Batman, we're going to draw like a big old U. If you're drawing along, make sure to take pictures for me. I, I, drew, I drew Wolverine sitting on a toilet last time. We're not doing that again. I'm gonna, but I am going to show you Adam West Batman. So, and then we'll do like a curvy V. Adam West Batman and then Adam West he's got he had like uh, the curvy eyebrow kind of deal a couple of oblong spheroids like not unlike the planet earth that we reside on and then a couple of eyes and for the eyes you can do a circle in a circle in a circle like circleception and Adam West was like crazy old, so we're just gonna put some little eye wrinkles on for his eyelids. And then he had like a really fancy mask back in the day. Had like stuff painted on it to make it look like he was a more had a better jawline and stuff than he actually did. And then they even painted on little eyebrows. Like that. And then we're going to do three little lines like that for the top of his mouth. Okay, I'll do that next, Joe. It's a good suggestion. And then we're going to do a curved line here. And then we're just going to do a couple little uh, suggestion lines for his bottom lip there. And then there's his top row teeth, and there's his bottom row teeth. Oh my god, I'm sweating. Why is it so hot down here? Then we'll give him like a little butt chin. Oh my god, it's Batman. Batman? Looks like the Joker's up to no good again. I think he might be plotting some no goodery do battery. Now we give him some, you know, kind of sloopy shoulders because Adam West never actually, like, exercised or anything. So, you know, we'll kind of, you know. And we'll give him, like, a bat symbol. Bat symbol's great. It's so fun to draw, and it's so easy. It's a C and a backward C. Then it's, you know, the top of Batman's head. 
and an upside down C, and an upside down C, and then C, 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 C. Are we good? Did you guys all draw Batman? Yeah, you did. Take your pictures. Send them to me. Say goodbye to Adam West again. Too soon? Too soon? That's okay. All right. I got to reposition here. That's kind of... <sighs> How's the sound, by the way? Can everyone hear me okay? I hope, I hope the sound's okay. Looks like I still got six people. Awesome. Thank you, guys. House is stark. All right. Let's... um. King Kong fighting Godzilla. Let's do it. So, first we're going to do some Godzilla here. I'm going to start with Godzilla's head. Like a curvy line. And then a couple of lumps for his eyes. And then we'll just continue that line to the eye ridge. And then we'll do like the oblong spheroids kind of deal, right? And then we'll, he's going to be like dinosaur shape because he's basically a dinosaur. Rawr. Give him some flaring nostrils. And some pupils. Yeah, that's got that's Godzilla, right? That's what he looks like. That's totally what he looks like. Yeah. And teeth are super easy. They're just little triangles. Rawr, rawr, I'm Godzilla. I'm going to eat King Kong. And then, if I remember right, he had these weird spikes. So it's like two lines. It's like the the rebel symbol or something. Does that look right to anybody? Does anybody remember this? Does that look right? <laughs> that looks wrong to me for some reason. Is that what Godzilla looks like? <laughs> yeah, it looks like Reptar, doesn't it? Totally does look like Reptar. No, because Reptar, it looks, you know what? He's going to be Reptar now. Fuck it. Because that's what... Yeah, that's that's who it is. There we go. Heck yeah. Perfect. And then Godzilla had some beefy arms. Little elbow. And then we're going to do like the claws. I like to do like a little line at the end. Like a curved line for the claw. Rawr. I'm Godzilla Jet. And we'll give him some more spiky, scaly things on the back. Now he's going to have a big, thick thigh and calf muscles. And then like a thumb on the back of his leg. And again, I'm leaving like a little line at the end for the claw. That looks stupid. I'll give him an ankle. And just draw a line to emphasize the musculature. Because Godzilla Reptar guy is a big, big honking boy. Are you guys doing good? I hope you're drawing along. Can't see around my mic. Oh my goodness. There we go. Looks like we lost some viewers. That's okay. We all know who. Guess they just don't want to learn to draw. 
This looks so stupid. Oh my god. I'm not on the game tonight. Uh, and then then we'll draw King Kong over here and we're going to draw that cool little loopy nose thing that I like to do it's pretty easy okay oh wait we gotta add some dark and we gotta show that his mouth has depth add a little a little color in there there we go. Look at that. That looks like a mouth. All right. So then here's King Kong. Give him a big old honker. And he's basically going to look like the gorilla that I drew last week, except bigger and angrier. It doesn't look like they're fighting. It looks like it looks like Reptar is explaining to Godzilla how uh, tax brackets work or something. Look, when you make over, you know, forty grand a year, then they put you into this next category. I don't fucking, I don't even, I don't know how that shit works either. Yeah, I don't think they're fighting anymore. I think that they're having some kind of. Uh, political discourse. So Godzilla is going to be here. Or King Kong, I should say. He's got his hand like this. And he's going to have his other hand down here. Because he's giving serious consideration to what Godzilla has to say. And he's gonna be sitting down. And he'll be sitting on a building. Mm, you made a good point, Godzilla. Maybe I should diversify my portfolio. Hmm. And that's how you draw Reptar and King Kong, essentially. Having an adult conversation. I hope you guys are having fun following along. <sighs> Fuck. Art. That's how we make art. And I think what we'll do is we'll, we'll do like this. And Godzilla's wearing bifocals. And then here comes his arm.
and Godzilla is now reading. He's evangelizing to King Kong about the Book of Mormon. He's saying, have you heard the good word, King Kong? Do you know who Joseph Smith was? King Kong's just trying to be polite, though, but he isn't buying any of this shit. So, that's how you draw that. Cool. I hope you guys are all following along, paying attention. Oh, I erased the part. Oh, no. Let's fix it now. You know what? He needs a little collar because they, they have to get dressed up. So he's wearing like a little tie. Yeah, there we go. There. That's fun. That's fun. When you die, you get your own planet. I swear. Welcome, new viewers. Thank you for joining us. Hope you're having a good time. I'm going to be taking another request for how to draw a thing. Um... Someone sent me a drawing. Let's see what we got here. It's not loading. All right. Well, we'll look at it here in a few minutes. So. <laughs> What's up, Matt? Thank you for checking in. This is fun. All right. Matt, I'm glad you're here. Uh, Matt, we're going to say goodbye to Mormon uh, Godzilla and patient King Kong. We're going to do another thing. So, Matt, why don't you make a request, Matt? You already know how to draw, but I'm going to say Matt a lot. Matt can draw real good, but let's see what he wants to uh, have me do. So, what should I, what should I art? Let's do it. Ooh, I got some pictures. People pe sending me pictures of stuff that they draw when I draw it. That's awesome. I cannot download pictures down here for some reason. Shit. How about a fan art of one of your tunes? Ooh, okay. Okay, we're going to draw. Oh, shit. I'm having a brain fart. Well, we're going to draw Mr. Static. I hate that. I hate that so much. Ugh. Okay, straight lines, yo. And then we'll give him a nice pointed chin. Some nostrils. And some eyebrows. Oh, I think I'm fucking up the nose. I think he's got a much smaller, pointier nose than that. I think he's got a goatee. I haven't, oh, I haven't checked the comic. It hasn't, hasn't been updated in a while, so I haven't looked at it. So. Hmm.
Wow, I feel like I'm really fucking this up. I don't know if I have enough black marker to draw one of Matt's tombs. Uh, it's like... It's like a scene kid cosplaying Marge Stimson. Fuck. I think we all get the basic idea here. I think he has like a bunch of earrings. I seriously haven't looked in a while. But then he's like distortingly tall and lanky. Man, Matt, why did you do this to me? This is embarrassing. Really fucking the dog here. Ugh. I've known Matt basically like my entire life, but I'm also at the same time his fan. So me trying to draw his dude. Ugh. Um... Nah, this is embarrassing. <sighs> but I remember in the comics, he's got he's got like a striped shirt on underneath his regular shirt. Doesn't he have black eyes in the comic? I'm waiting for Matt. I think he had black eyes in the comic, like completely black. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do like this. I think he has like the kind of like the chin strap going on, just just faintly. He's got he's definitely got a good goatee going. Then he has like a Viking knot in it. Something like that. And then, um, I don't know why I drew this arm all the fucking way over here. That's kind of unfortunate because now he needs to be doing something. Um, so, hmm. we'll do it like this. And he's going to be elbowing. Um, hmm. Who could he possibly be elbowing? He did a, okay, he had a full on a beard, okay. Yeah, I feel a little better about this. I'm, it's, I, we're getting there. 
basically Wayne Static. Um, ugh, that, looks, that looks like hot garbage. Anyway, uh, and then he's going to be wearing um, a shirt that says, uh, it's, it's got a squid on it, because why not? Because I don't know what Wayne said I could wear. There, how's that? Now it's all of it. It's Otsego, and there's the tip. Just for you, Matt. Oh, do you have black tiny eyes. So like, um, almost like a Calvin and Hobbes kind of deal. Like, uh, like that. <laughs> oh, Jesus. We have fun. <sighs> But we can fix those shoulders. They don't quite look right, do they? No, they don't, Matt. Huh? Yeah, they look stupid. Let's let's try and make that one a little better. He's gonna have some. He's got a little bit of traps on him. No, no, I wrecked it. Uh, I wrecked it. Fuck. Uh, whatever. Anyways. That's the picture of Matt's character that is, uh, you know, a lot less than subtle lot to Wayne Static because we grew up listening to Static X. Yep. Matt, plug your plug your uh, comic because I don't remember the name of it because all I can think of is Shakes and Fidget, that shitty mobile game. It's... Uh... Skits on punk. Skits on punk. Fuck. Jesus, that took forever. I am so sorry, Matt. Oh, anyway. Yep, so there's that one. So thank you, everybody, for this one. Yes, Skits on punk on Webtoons. Check it out. It's amazing. You should definitely look at his comic, his webcomic. Um, but there we are. So screenshot it while you can, because I'm going to erase it now. And we're going to move on to the next one. Oh, God, no, Wayne Static again. Shit. That was fun and nerve-wracking, because um, if you've seen any of Matt's art, um, I'm not one to emulate stuff like that, because he's very good. Anyway, who's got... Another suggestion. If you guys can get more people in here, we've been in for 49 minutes, 39 minutes. Okay. My cutoff is, is two hours unless I get tired or my wife calls me. So if you guys get more people in here, say we get 20 people in here, then we'll play some Pictionary. How about that? So get your friends in. We'll play some Pictionary. We'll get some, some, uh, get a game going. In the meantime, if anyone else has another request, we will do another picture. I want to draw for you. I want to teach you how to draw. I still can't look at the pictures that people are sending me. But that's okay. What do you want me to teach you how to draw with my limited skills? <clears throat> <clears throat> Cracking my knuckles. 
close. This just became an ASMR drawing. Sorry, I apologize for that. Yoshi. Cool. Yoshi's fun. This is a good one for kids. But my videos are not for kids. Because I'm a horrible, horrible example for children. So, Yoshi. Stop me if I'm going too fast for you guys. It's a series of circles for the eyes and then a couple of lines. Drawing vertically sucks. Grits and Guts, hello. Welcome to the show. Thank you for joining us. I'm drawing Yoshi right now per request. But uh, I'll be taking more requests soon. And he got some thick legs too. Yoshi can do some squats. I don't, this doesn't look right. Why didn't this look right? I haven't played Super Nintendo in so long. I don't remember Yoshi now. Huh. That looks wrong to me. I don't like this. Huh. Well, Grits and Guts said zombies, so you know what we gotta do? We gotta change this up now. Now we're going to make this some fun shit. Grits and guts like zombies. So we're going to do some. No, we can do this better. We can do better. I believe in us. I, I believe, I believe in you guys. You believe in me? You believe in magic. <laughs> Just a series of curves and triangles for that. And then, uh, let's see. We're going to, oh shit, I dropped my thing. Uh, let's see here. Then we're going to draw a horrible wound and Yoshi's exposed rib cage and some bones and then some internal organs. Oh no, God, no, Yoshi, why? What? Why did it have to Yoshi? No. Oh, we're going to have some stuff hanging out. Oh, no. And then we're going to do the tongue. I'm not talking, I'm sorry. I got quiet there for a second. I got really into this. <laughs> 
got really into Zombie Yoshi eating Toad, but I apologize. Mario Yoshi! See Mario save the kingdom now. He's probably got to have like some bloodshot eyes. And then this arm's probably just bones. Because he's a zombie. Just like that. Oh, look at that. You thought Bowser was bad. Welcome to the Mushroom Kingdom, bitch. I dropped my pen cap. Hold on. This is fun. We have a good time. I love doing this. This is going to be a regular thing. I just wish we had more people involved so we could have a big party. But if you guys like, share, and subscribe, tell your friends. We can do bigger shows, bigger. I want to do contests and stuff, you know, play Pictionary and all that jazz. But were your kids able to follow along? I hope you're drawing at home. Did you draw zombie Yoshi eating toad? Send me your pictures. All right, say goodbye to Yoshi. All right. Another art bites the dust. I am so sweaty. <laughs> Weekend is for whole shit and arts. Yup. Sure is. Let's do some art. Give me your suggestions. What would you guys like to see me draw? Tell your kid, tell your wife, we're drawing everybody in here. Zombie Paw Patrol. Hell yeah. I just have to draw, or I have to look up Paw Patrol. Hold on. <clears throat> Looking up Paw Patrol on Google. <laughs> oh, fuck yeah. I'm going to draw, draw some zombie Paw Patrol. That's cool. All right, well, first I got to just draw Paw Patrol, and then I can uh, make them into zombies. So we'll do that first. So first, we're going to do a little fire engine guy. So we'll do like a little, he's just got like a little triangle for a nose. And he's got like a weird little, weird little smile. And let's see, you can kind of see his teeth in there. He's got like just a hint of a point. And like this. Yeah, why not? Why not? None of this matters. None of this matters. Eh, who gives a fuck? Right? So we'll do like a... Gonna draw some children's cartoons that they couldn't actually watch cause it's bad. Cause it's bad for their brains. Actually, I don't even know if this show is any good for children as it is. Doesn't seem like it would be. Seems like it'd just be stupid, but whatever. Oh, okay. So. I'm just going to real quick just kind of blast through drawing these stupid things. 
from this dumb kids cartoon. It looks like his ear is just kind of like flapping in the breeze behind him. And he's got some spots. And there's his collar. And then we've got the cop one. Again, apologize for some of the quality here, but I am just trying to rush through because there's four of these fucking guys. So he's got like a he's like a German Shepherd, huh? Weird. The cop one is a Nazi dog. That's weird. He's got like the ah fuck. He's got the dog shape. Dog nose. It's got a big, stupid smile. You can see his tongue in there. He's got some fangs. And he's got like the fucking dog stripe. His big, stupid eyes. And then they kind of box in his face with color. He's got some eyebrows. Seriously, just, you know, sketching this shit as fast as I can so I can get to the fun part. And, oh, he's got a badge for a collar. How fucking adorable. Oh, he's got, he's got little... What is he? He's got little stripes. What is he, like a sergeant or some shit? Who hired him? You're a fucking dog. Uh, Paw Patrol! Paw Patrol! Somebody knows their names. That's weird. Alright, and then there's the girl one. She's got like a rounder face. And around her nose. And again, a big stupid smile. And she's got she got some fucking teeth on her. Jesus. And then she's like she's got this kind of coloring going on. And she's got this big, poofy tuft of hair. What is she, like a fucking pilot or something? All right, and then she's got like this weird coloring around her eyes. Oh, she already is, she's, I'm making her look kind of nuts. I don't know if I like this. Yeah, she look kind of she's looking kind of dangerous here. The fuck did I do? Oh, she's got these big stupid ears. <laughs> I'm a dog too. Ah, I'm safe. Let me rescue your children. Ah. All right, let's draw some, some paws in here. Oh, he's got he's got big old doggy feet. And he's like going like this. He's got big stupid dog feet too. Ugh. Children's cartoons hurt my feelings with their existence. Stupid. Why do they all have freckles? All right. From Populous Michael. Hmm. All right. 
And then we got to draw this derpy looking one who does construction apparently. This whole cartoon seems to be some kind of a statement on the socio-political climate. I don't know if I like any of this. That's yeah, that's not at all what a construction helmet looks like. What am I doing? And then this one's all fat and derpy looking. It's got like a Sonic the Hedgehog nose and a stupid little derpy smile. Like an orc or something. Oh my god, my hands are shaking. I can't even draw straight fucking lines. Does he even have ears? Yeah, I guess he's got ears. Something like that. I do the construction. I'm the construction dog. Oh, he's got a badge too. Oh, that's cute. They let him participate. Yep, there's that dumb shit. There's Paw Patrol. Did you follow me? Did you learn how to draw Paw Patrol? Because I'm about to fucking ruin it for you. All right. So everyone get a good look at Paw Patrol now, and then we're going to compare this to afterwards. Oh, wait, he's got... A, I forgot his badge. He's got a badge. All right. All right, now let's make this shit fun. We'll make this shit into zombies. Okay, so first off, um, we're going to have to do something about this jawline. So when I'm drawing a zombie, I like to start with a bunch of little curves. I don't need that shit anymore. Bunch of little curves for the teeth, right? So we're gonna focus on the canines. And then we'll just draw some triangles for that part. And then we're gonna draw the bottom of the jaw and we'll do some more curves for more teeth. And then we got to fix this collar. And then we'll uh, kind of like just do like an eye socket here. And then we're going to, we're just going to kind of make his eyes look, his other eye look like it's empty. Like it's empty and dead because he's a zombie dog. He doesn't want to rescue you. He wants your brains. And then just to make him a little scarier, we'll give him some claws. See, we're off to a good start. There's one. There's one. And maybe, uh, okay. So then this one, let's see. We're gonna start by making his pupils white. Okay. And then we're gonna open his mouth wide, give him way more teeth than a dog has business having.
And then, just for giggles, we're going to turn his sheriff's badge upside down. Oh no, what's this? Satan. Oh, you're supposed to be an officer of the law. What are you doing? Oh, God, no. Think of the children. And then her. We're not going to do much to her because I already drew her kind of scary as fuck. So what we're just going to do here is we're going to we're going to make her mouth appear bigger by filling in the darkness in there. The darkness. Just like, a, I don't know, optical illusion or some shit. Then we're also going to, like, extend her tongue out. Like that. Maybe give her some, some spittle coming out. Right? Maybe make her nostrils flare. And then we're just going to give her these tiny pupils. Look how much more fucking terrifying she is. And then maybe we'll give her some... Fucking bags under her eyes, right? Maybe, uh, make it look like her eyes are open wider. Right? Then, uh, yeah, I don't have to do much, her, because she already looked scary as fuck. <laughs> and then this one. This little chubby little guy. We're gonna make him um And now, instead of running to the rescue, he's running for his fucking life. No, guys, I thought we was friends. There you go. That's, uh, well, that looks lumpy as shit. Clean that up. Don't send me any lumpy shit. I will reject it. Even though this, this whole thing is a train wreck. Oh no! We was friends! How's that? Zombie Paw Patrol. And of course they're going to eat this one. Ah, <sighs> That was fun. You guys are great. Thank you for sticking around. Thank you for watching my dumb shit again. I hope you guys are having as much fun as I am. I wish I could tell who's still in here. I can't see like, um, I don't see a way to view my views. I don't know how to do that. You guys having fun though? I don't know what all this shit does. I hope you guys are enjoying yourselves. Hope you're. If you're new here, please like and share and subscribe. Join my uh, join my YouTube channel. We're trying to build an audience here because uh, my motto, especially now that it's like the fucking apocalypse, is try to be the bright spot on someone's shitty day. Because you know what? Lots of people are having a shitty day right now. Every day. Every day sucks. So why not just try to make someone smile? A lot of people make me smile. And I have a lot of shitty days. So let's do this. Oh, that's cool. Thank you, Grits and Guts. That's nice to know. Um, oh, Matt, are you still here? Thank you, Matt. You just sent me a compliment. I'm a, I don't know if you're in here still or not, but.
Sorry, I don't like to play on my phone while I'm doing one of these videos, but, you know. Anyways, everyone say goodbye to the zombie uh, fucking rescue dog, guys. Um, yep, say goodbye to Paws Patrol. Oh, no! This was, that was, that was an interesting one. That was good. I like a challenge. I don't like, I don't like, um, this board very much or drawing white too much, you know, the whiteboard, but, um, that's okay. I don't like drawing vertically. I don't like a lot of things. That's okay. I'm, I'm a complaining uh, bitch. It's all good. Evan, you in here? Uh. Evan, you watching? How about Ben? Who are my regulars in here? Jen, I saw you're still here. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Um, who else has a suggestion? Who wants to see me draw? Who has a suggestion or has a request? Who wants to see me draw? Stupid. Good God, I'm sweating. Well. Crumbopulous Michael. I don't remember which one that is. I have to look it up. I know it's from Rick and Morty. Oh, fuck. Yeah. Crum. 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 That guy, that fucking guy, Crown Populus Michael. Hell yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, this is fun. We'll enjoy this one. Crown Bop. Yup. So he's like a bug guy from Rick and Morty. This is a fun one. Crown Bop Ulyss Michael. Crown Bop Ulyss Michael. Cool. Thank you. I'm still going to fuck it up, but thank you. So he's, he's like a bug guy, bug alien from uh, Rick and Morty, one of the upper tier ones, because it looks like there's like different uh, cast systems of bugs in that show. So it's kind of, I imagine that the ones with the claw arms are like the worker drones, kind of. But so you're going to start with two circles for eyes. And then underneath that, you're going to do these little dooley bobbers. Just like that. And he's got like little kind of snoot holes right there. And then uh, just some uh, faint crisscross lines for his eyes. And then we'll do a rounded line for his face. And they've got pretty rounded heads. Maybe not quite that fat, though. Not quite that fat of a head. Okay. Then he's got, like, gill-looking things on the side of his face. And he's got two little dooley bob things up here. And he doesn't quite have hair. He's got, like, these other little doodly bobbies right up there. So, something like that. He's got eyebrows. Because, you know, why not give a bug eyebrows? That looks a little bit chonky for me. I don't quite like that. And then he's got on his, like, life support space suit deal. It's got, like, cool future lights on it. He's got like, his spacesuit is kind of like armor, I guess, because he's a hitman. He's an outer space hitman. 
he's got like vest. Something like that. And then I don't remember what his arms exactly look like. I know he's got the claws going. We're going to give him like a uh, I don't really know how the fuck a guy like him is going to wield a weapon of any kind because he's got these weird bug claw things, but we'll give him some kind of a blaster. I imagine these things were modeled after Greedo or something. Oh, it's hard to do this shit vertically. All my ideas are like good in theory, but then in practice, they're like hard to do. It's just a series of lines. And then we'll give it like an antenna because, you know, future shit has antennas. And we'll give like some grippies on there, maybe some buttons and dials. Yeah. Crown Bopulous Michael. Holy shit, I'd fucking drew him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah boy I just sure love killing oh here I go killing again that's what I do I just love killing I'll kill anybody old people young people children pets as long as the price is right And maybe clean up those extra lines around the eyes. And, you know, if it wasn't a whiteboard thing, I probably would have made sure the eyes were the same size. But, I mean, Dan Arndt doesn't make sure his eyes are all the same size. In fact, they're usually not. So, I guess who gives a fuck, right? Not Dan Arndt. Dan, what the fuck is his name? Harmon. Dan Harmon. The other person is someone I was arguing with on Facebook. Oops. Oh, well. I don't give a shit. So, yeah, there's a Crombopulous Michael. Remember the name. All right, everyone say goodbye to Crombopulous. Bye, goodbye. Goodbye, Crombopulous. Thank you, Grits and Guts. I appreciate the compliment. I think we'll do one more. I don't really have enough people to uh, do the game tonight, unfortunately. I wanted to play Pictionary, but we don't have a big crowd. So I think I'll do one more drawing. So anybody that wants me to do uh, another suggestion, I'll show you how to draw. You can learn. I'm basically the next... Um... The next uh, Bob Ross. Yeah, I'm like, I'm, I'm Bob Ross. First, we're going to draw some. We're going to draw a nice little mountain lion. Right there. Just a couple of lines for some mountain peaks. There you go. Oh, we got a suggestion for Darkwing Duck. So fuck the Bob Ross thing. We're going to draw Darkwing Duck. I'm going to try to draw him from memory, and it's going to be awful. Darkwing Duck. All right. So, let's see. I know he's got, like, a Ninja Turtles mask going on. Right? And he's got his big floppy ass hat. Okay. And then how big are their beaks? In that fucking show. Let's 
does not look right to me. <laughs> I don't think this is quite right. <laughs> That doesn't look right. Well, that's fine. Let's see, and I know he's wearing a trench coat and maybe a turtleneck. Let's see. Yeah, I think he wore a turtleneck and a trench coat with a belt. And he had like the 80s shoulder pads going on. God, I mean, I think I'm close, but it doesn't feel right. Because I'm pretty sure, yeah, I'm pretty sure he had on a turtleneck. A duck wearing a turtleneck. What are some other animal clothes that we could make f fucking animals wear? Oh, that was terrible. Is that right? Did he have duck feet or was he wearing shoes? God, I kind of feel like he wore shoes, but still no pants. Does that seem right to anybody? I think you'd see his butt hanging out, too. I think it was like classic Disney where you could see his butt hanging out. So it was like, there's his, like, duck crotch. And then he had on, like, some, some duck-looking dress shoes or something. This concerns me. I'm highly bothered by how wrong this looks. I know it's wrong. And then he had like a a, a a gun that did like everything. It was like his one tool that he had in his arsenal. It was like a grappling gun and uh and lasers. I don't fucking know. Okay. Uh, so we'll look it up now. And we'll see what he actually looked like. Okay. So this is. Dark. Wing. Duck. From. Memory. Okay, now let's find him out. Oh, my wife sent me a thing. Uh oh, I hope the riots aren't going fucking bananas downtown. She got home. My wife went to the protest today. She wanted to do her part. I stayed home with the kids. Um. Oof. Okay, it's not even working. Sorry to pause here. Dark wing duck. Oh yeah, no, I drew I fucked that up pretty bad. Yep, okay. So here's the real dark wing duck. So So he's got like a stretched out face. Yeah, we can do this. We can do it when we know what shit looks like, huh? It's not so bad. And you can see like most of his eye. And I was kind of on the right track with the mask, at least. 
A little bit. A little bit. Then we go here. Yeah, it's not so bad when I know what it looks like. And then, uh, let's see, he's got the hand up here. He does wear a coat that's got buttons on it. And he's got this big ass cape. He does wear a turtleneck. I was right about that. What do you know? Now I'm kind of fucking up the turtleneck, but whatever. We're having fun. He does wear a weird looking coat. Oops, my image went all wonky. And you can see his ass. His ass is out, just like I thought. Darkwing Duck's ass is out. So he fights crime with his crotch out where God and everybody can see it. Wow, what a pervert. Is he fighting crime or is he the crime? I think uh, Darkwing Duck should be put on some kind of a fucking list, you guys. Because, uh, I don't know, I don't trust him. Seems like a weirdo pervert to me, but... Then his legs, you probably can't see down there, but it's just like a series of lines. And then hes he is a barefoot duck, but they don't put like hardly any fucking detail into that shit. It's just uh, some lumps and lines. And I'm, I'm kind of fucking the feet up a little bit, but it doesn't matter. No one gives a shit. And his cape is just all over the fucking place because it's huge and impractical. So, I lost my fucking thing again. Shit. Oh, there it is. He's flashing crime, not fighting it. I agree. So there's my Darkwing Duck. And that's the actual one. How'd I do? I do okay? I don't suck too bad, right? That was fun. This has been fun. So send me your Darkwing Ducks. Send me the pictures you sent. Or you drew. Um, I'm going to wrap it up now because my wife is home. And I want to go... Spend some time with her because she went to the protest downtown and it sounds like after she got home, shit went bananas. And I'm really relieved that she's here. Guys, shit's getting crazy out there. It's like there's fucking diseases and chaos and people with guns and violence and riots and looting and fires and cops killing people and people killing cops and fuck, we're all doomed. So... I'm going to keep doing this shit. Try to take your mind off it for a bit. So let's have some fun. Share my videos, please. Uh, send them to your friends. Get your friends to subscribe. Have them share to friends. Let's do a pyramid scheme. But let's get people involved. Let's, uh, please, let's get people on the channel because I want to I wanna share and make people smile and laugh. This will be fun. So I love you guys. Please stay safe. Wash your hands. Brush your teeth. Social distance. Don't set shit on fire. Um, yeah, be safe out there. Okay, guys, this has been a lot of fun and I really appreciate this. Uh, thanks for coming again. Please pass this around, share it to your friends. Let's get, let's get some involvement. Let's get some people watching so we can do a lot more. The more we grow, the more we can do. So I really want to get a big channel so I can just, I don't know, get more people involved and make people happy and maybe we can get together and do some positive shit in the world. So awesome. Again, thank you guys. I love you. Be safe. Be the bright spot on someone's shitty day.